People living in one Chattanooga neighborhood are anxious and angry over crime. Good afternoon. I'm Calvin Sneed. And I'm Latricia Thomas. People in the Ridgedale neighborhood want police to do something about crime, but they just don't want to talk about it. News Channel 9's Alyssa Sperato talked with one business owner who is speaking out tonight. Alyssa. Kevin Latricia Gary Bell's construction business has been on 14th Street for more than 25 years. But now he says enough is enough and is not afraid to step forward, even though others won't. Yes, I'm afraid, but I, I mean, what use do, does it do to not step forward? If you ask Gary Ball about what he thinks about Ridgedale, all he can say is he's fed up. I've said enough was enough for years. That's why I've been going to police meetings. That's why... I continue to uh, try to get somebody to step up to the plate. His business, Tower Construction, has sat on East 14th Street for more than two decades. He says this area has been a haven for crime ever since he can remember. Within the last 18 months, two homicides at one address. The latest one happened just yesterday. Leslie Townsend was found shot to death in his car. In March 2011, Robert Moore was shot outside the same home. A home that Ball and many other neighbors say was built by Habitat for Humanity. Terrible Ball says that Habitat home has become a nightmare for many residents. One. If you could get people to talk down there that own their homes, they would say that's the worst thing that ever happened. But there's just one problem. We knocked on more than a dozen doors in the area. Every neighbor refused to speak on camera. The main reason, they didn't want to get involved or didn't want to be targeted. We have people that, that are just scared to death. And uh, they, they, don't want to, they don't want to be a seen. They don't want people to know they're complaining. They just sit hunkered down in their house hoping that they're not the one that's next. Now, we did go to Habitat for Humanity's office today where they refused to speak about the matter, only saying they would look into it. Gary Ball says Habitat could fix the growing crime problem by keeping a closer eye over their property. Latricia. Alyssa, thanks so much.